looking to expand your indoor cardio library, check out this video for more options on how to get your cardio in inside. Hey, welcome back everybody to this week's edition of Two Minute Tuesdays. Now this week, we're talking to those of you who want to get your cardio in, but you're not into running. You still need to be working out at home, but running really isn't your thing. What can you be doing at home to make sure you still get your cardio in, but you don't have to run? Tip number one, make sure you vary the motions that your body is doing when you're doing cardio. When you think about running outside or biking or walking, a lot of the motions that we tend to jump to for cardio, it's a lot of forward and back with our lower body. Think about including exercises that, yes, are forward and back, but also that could be side to side and maybe a rotational component. So vary the motions that your body is doing during cardio. Tip number two, use stairs or other structures of your house to help get your workout in. Moving up and down your stairs at whatever pace can be a tremendous challenge for your cardiovascular system. So utilizing the built-in structure of your home, such as stairs, can prove extremely beneficial when wanting to get your cardio in but not wanting to run. Tip number three, make sure you maintain your focus on getting cardio in and not other things. What I mean by that is a lot of times we think about when I need to get my cardio in, I have to do full range of motion, doing these crazy intense exercises where actually the goal of cardiovascular exercise is to get your heart rate up. So even if you take an exercise you've seen on a show or at the gym, you can make that motion a lot smaller. A great example of this is a jump squat. So maybe you don't do a full squat and a full jump, but you do a tiny squat and a tiny jump. Give yourself permission to modify different cardio exercises so that you can continue to do them rather than feel like every exercise takes a huge toll on your body. Check out the expanded version of this on our blog and tune in next week Tuesday for another two-minute topic.